When you think of New England, you might think of fall foliage, or snow, or calves, but I think of long-standing, family-owned candy shops where you can get all your holiday treats and stocking stuffers. That's why this month's mini-series is focused on New England confectionaries, and today we are at Furlong's Candies in Norwood, Mass. This little shop off of Route 1 has been making homemade chocolates for over 80 years, and you can see they even added an ice cream window pictured here. In operation since 1929, Furlong's has always taken pride in the quality of their products. And that's something you'll notice when you come in here and see all the ladies making chocolate molds and organizing the candy counter. According to the Norwood Historical Society, Furlong's was originally located in the Norwood Theater Building, and they even had a roadside stand in Mellis Mass in the 50s. The Norwood Historical Society provided this photo of a 1956 advertisement that Furlong's posted in the local high school yearbook. And the photo on your screen now is of the Norwood Theater Building from 2018. Furlong's would have been in either the retail shop to the left or right of the main theater entrance. And I did find this other photo from 1951 that shows a woman standing in front of the candy shop, but it's hard for me to pinpoint whether this was the left shop or the right shop. What do you guys think? Or does anyone watching know which side Furlong's used to be on? Leave a comment below if you do because I'd really like to know. I was a little overwhelmed in Furlong's today. There were so many choices. Pecan turtles, almond turtles, peanut butter cups, milk chocolate or dark chocolate, discounted Halloween treats. I finally settled on chocolate covered Twinkies, chocolate dipped peeps, a pecan turtle, and an almond turtle, all with dark chocolate. And yes, these treats were all very delicious. But the people in the shop are so friendly, it made the whole experience that more enjoyable. I've been coming here to pick up chocolate covered cherries for my grandmother each Christmas since I was a little kid. And I hope that Furlongs attracts lots of business over the coming years so that I can continue that tradition. And so you can come and check them out too, of course. If you liked this video, make sure you subscribe so you can see all my videos once they're uploaded each week. And you may even enjoy my previous candy shop video on the Keller House in Laconia, New Hampshire. I'll put a link to that on the screen so you can click over to that. 